Howdy guys, welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. This is Nintendo Capri Sun. There's the bell I cleaned, and there's the one I haven't cleaned yet, over by the Yursh. So I got up here without Yursh. Because I already opened this world. Yeah, of course. This is the third shine in Sirena Beach, and quite a pain in the ass, if I do say so myself. Of course, I've been using that expression, pain in the ass, pretty liberally. Almost too much so. I don't know if I would call myself a liberal, but... Mm. Cha, ha ha. Let's do some triple jumps. Woo! Pew! This, um, shine is, like, really... Is a, it seems to, uh, puzzle a lot of people from what I've seen on message boards. And it puzzled me for about 20 minutes yesterday until finally I just looked online I'm like, oh, screw it. I got so mad, I was like, frrr. Okay, so here's what you do. I know how to do this now, so don't worry. You see a Yoshi here, he wants a pineapple. If you look around in here, there's fruits, like over here. But there's every kind of fruit but a pineapple. Those are the ones that look like a pineapple without the green thing on top of them. You can kick them around. But that's not the one he wants. He doesn't want a pear, or cantaloupe, bananas, none of that crap. Uh, so what do you do to get the pineapple? Well, you can look all over the place till high heaven if you're not going to find one. Unless you do this. Well, you don't have to do this. You don't have to talk to this guy. But he gives you kind of a clue. He says water damage in the restrooms. That is so low class. So if you check the bathroom, or the restroom, or whatever, you do see, like, well, I don't know if you'd call that water damage, it just looks like water, um, draining from the ceiling. Turns out, you can jump through the ceiling here. And I had, uh, on my 2007 DVD, I was looking through the walkthrough as I was recording, because I just couldn't figure it out. And I read the words on the walkthrough, I was like, go to the bathroom. And I'm like, oh, go to the bathroom, so I'm supposed to go in the bathroom! So then I spent like the next five minutes of saying, IN THE BATHROOM, every like five seconds. Just like... <coughs> Dang it. Ugh, I don't know why. It's, it, he doesn't say it like that in the song. He doesn't say it all like throaty like that. But get this door over here. There's going to be a lot of this crap where you have to like spray things and make them flip over to make a certain pattern. There's going to be more of that later, so don't worry. Hopefully, in this video, if we could ever get this freaking door to turn around. Howdy, I'm speaking here now with Katherine Hepburn's mom. Would you stop that? Tell me, why did you throw the blue heart of the ocean over the railing of the Titanic? Did you feel bad letting Leo DiCaprio drown while you were floating on the big door? Could you have taken turns? Or were you too afraid to freeze your big fat ass off? Well, I guess that's just how life is. Some some people are in a comfy news studio while I'm on a stupid boat with a stupid hat. Crap. While I'm playing Super Mario Sunshine. Okay, anyway. So you gotta get through the ceiling. It's kind of hard, but once you get the hang of it, it's not too bad. I'm surprised I did it that fast, actually. Anyway, this guy's your clue right here is where the pineapple is. He says, where? Have you seen a pineapple anywhere around here? So when he says that, you know you're close. But first, spray the poster here and grab yourself a blue coin. Dang it, I shouldn't have saved. Now, because if I screw this up, I won't be able to... St well, I do have my file copied. Anyway, the tiles on the floor, different color. You can stomp through them. Then stomp the cases. And there's your pineapple. Now, here's the p here's the other part that pisses me off about this particular stage. See, there's a boo over here. Now, if you've played the game before, you know that the purpose of getting Yoshi in the stage is to eat the boos, right? So, if you're coming through it a second time and you haven't played it in a while, you'll probably see that boo there and you're thinking, Okay, i got to get the Yoshi to come here and eat that boo. Well, don't do that. Because if you do, you get stuck, and you'll have to let your Yoshi die. Because you get stuck, and he can't go through the doors. And you can't go back through that boo picture that I sprayed earlier, because it's just a mirror on the other side. What you have to do with the Yoshi is take him up to the third floor here. Go a totally different way than what you just did to get to that. I mean, if you do go up there and have him eat that boo, there's a blue coin behind him. Which is ridiculous that you should go that far out of your way for a blue coin. Try to keep your sense of direction a little bit around here, too. You can see the shines right there. That's the one we're going to get. But we can't get through this glass no matter what we do. You can shoot it with a M16. It wouldn't do any good. So you have to jump on the bed through the ceiling into the attic here and eat the booze. And since the shine was back this way, we'll head this way. And we should have it in a short amount of time. Now, sometime later, you'll have a red coin challenge where you have to pick them all up in five minutes, and those are hard as hell to find, too. Because you'll have to cover every inch of this hotel to get them all. But it's really fun. I mean, I like this hotel. It's a cool place. Again, with the tiles being in different patterns, so you know which one to stomp, and there you go. The first shine with Yoshi, I think we've picked up. <laughs> Yoshi! So happy. 
I did that on my DVDs a lot too. I was like so happy. Some of the sounds he makes, he just sounds like he's so happy. So I'm like, Meow. anyway. Noki Bay. Stop showing me Noki Bay. I don't want to go back to that infernal place. Okay, so in we go again. I love this world. I'm never going to stop. Would you get in the pipe? Quit doing your acrobatics. Oh, yes, my aerobics. Yeah, I'll do that. Secret of Casino Delfino. Great. Just the episode Luca Jin wants to see. Seeing as how she works in one, she probably gets sick of it. Sick of those roulette wheels and those constantly, you know, screaming slot machines that are all in exactly the same key. It's basically like hearing a resolved chord over and over again. Even when I go there just for fun, I get sick of it. I don't even know how she deals with it. Well, she doesn't actually work in a casino. It's like one of the shops on the outside of the casino. And it's cool stuff. I'm not going to say too much about that because I don't know if you're going to be talking about other people's personal lives on here. It's kind of like, you know, it's not good form. Anyway, so here we go. To the casino. Big giant roulette wheel. A little bit later, there will be a purple one on here you'll have to stomp through. So you got two slot machines in here. You should go to the left one first. Otherwise, the right one will never give you what you want. What you want to get is triple sevens. And uh, this one... You'll have to spray them each individually to make them go around. Once you have a 7, you can stop spraying it. Oh man, I was just about to get a 7 on that one. There we go. Oh, scratching my head, sorry. Oh, uh, there we go. Okay. Now you go to the one across the way here. Pew! And this one will actually spray all three of them when you spray it, so... You only have to spray it once. Ooh, three coins. No? Wow, that's the first time I've seen it do that in a while. Normally it matches every time. Aw. How long are we going to have to sit here playing the slots, man? Let's play slots. I don't want your freaking coins. I don't want your booze either. And you know what else? I don't want your freedom! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Figure as long as I'm doing careless whisper videos, might as well do freedom. Alright. Yeah, I think we got it this time. No! You fart knocker! I almost had it that time! That's strange. The blue... Wait, what? I see those stars overhead. They seem to... Be changing like colors. It's kind of freaky. All right. At least you can do this as many times as you want, but I'm gonna fast forward. This takes too much longer here. In fact, I should have uh, probably started fast forwarding from the beginning. Maybe you have to like spray it on a certain spot. Yeah, you have to wait for it to finish spinning before. We're not even close to done with the shine yet, y'all. So don't even get your hopes up. Uh, <laughs> it's not gonna pop out of there with the shine. Yeah, I got more water. Cool. Yeah, they drop water in here just in case something like this happens. You know, because you don't have all the water in the world. What is this now? Did I not get all sevens over there? Yeah, I did. Come on now. I don't have all the money in the world. Well, I do. You don't, but I do. Shoot. Another boo. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. There we go. And that opens up the next puzzle. Now this puzzle is a real pain in the ass. What I like to do is pretty much work from top to bottom, because you're more likely to accidentally spray ones that you don't want to spray underneath, so you should try to go across the top, and yeah, at least that's how I always did it. So. Yeah, and just try not to hit any ones that you don't mean to hit, you know. And if you still see a question block, just keep spraying it till it turns the right way. And, uh, don't... Yeah. I mean, it's pretty obvious what I'm doing here, right? I don't have to explain this or anything, because that would be really stupid. Oh man, get your ass on the other side. There we go, now. Go down to level 3 here. So DEFCON 3 is more like it. Would you turn? I keep, like, spraying it the wrong way, I think. Don't spray the one above it now, either. Okay, we almost got this. Hey, alright. Now the bottom. No, don't... Uh, you you already got that one! There we go. No. 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 There we go. Just real light. Tap it. I guess that works. Whatever. Okay. But guess what? We're still not done yet. Now we have the secret area! Oh my god, you gotta love this, don't you? You gotta love this game. I swear, man. Jeez, I'm already up to 10.35 here. It's like, well, I guess we'll do this next time. No, I'm doing it now. Damn it. I don't care what I have to fast forward. Are you kidding me? Okay, maybe we will have to fast forward this. Ugh. Jeez, Louise. This one's not that bad, so don't let my tomfoolery lead you into thinking this is hard. This is not hard. I love how the background of this one looks like Sirena Beach. All the other ones have Super Mario Brothers backgrounds, but this one's the beach. I always thought that was kind of weird. 
It's just a sort of, you know, I guess the ambiance is just so addictive that they decided to forego the Super Mario Brothers in favor of that. Uh, maybe we'll pick that up. Nah, screw the one-up. Remember what happened last time? Me and the one-up broke up. We had a nasty divorce. We had to take it to court and everything. Okay, here we go. This block is not a big deal. I'm not worried about it. It's these guys. These jumps can be a little... Because you, know, you don't want to not jump, but that's the problem if you don't. There. Okay, now we just get on top of this and make our run. We And then we have a huge, huge, huge block here. It's going to turn all kinds of different directions. But, again, it's nothing to worry about. It just keeps doing it, though. I tell you. Two times in a row, man. Yes! Alright, that's all for this episode of Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. Next time, I have no idea what I'm going to do. And that feels great to know that, you know?